Hello and welcome to this very quick video for those of you that may be seeing this error when you've set up Yapu on your radio. Now Yapu is this incredible script that runs on things like this TX16S radio but lots and lots of others and it takes the telemetry coming down from something like an RD pilot plane which is here at the side and displays it on the screen. However, something that I see an awful lot is the error where it says no telemetry here right in the middle of the screen. And Although you can see the sensors and everything else coming through, it isn't working. Now I'm making this video more for myself, just for all of you out there that may be experiencing this issue, because occasionally I bump into this if I haven't done it for a little while and I have to remember how to do it. And it's specifically something to do with the fact that we have Express LRS and CRSF as the link between the radio and the model. So first thing we need to do is actually go onto the computer. Now I'm connected here via RD Pilot and Mission Planner onto the flight controller, and we need to check that one thing is set up, and that's RC option. And in here, we have the ability to set the bit mass. If I click on here, the one that we need to make sure is selected is use pass through for CRSF telemetry. Why do we need that? Well, that is the pass-through stuff that was added a very long time ago for free sky stuff that Yapu originally used to use. And it encases all of the telemetry information into the CRSF telemetry, so that comes back. How do we know it's coming back on the radio? Well, if we go into the model settings, into things like the telemetry stuff, you can see the first six or seven, which are the standard things you get back from all Express LRS receivers with link quality and other bits and bobs. But if I quickly scroll down, you'll also see that we're also getting ground speed, heading, altitude, number of satellites that it's got, the receiver batteries, current capacity, all that stuff is down here. If you are getting this stuff updated, then it means that that bit is working great. However, even with all that set, you can get the situation where it says on the screen, no telemetry in your Yapu stuff. So there's one other thing you need to check. If we go into system and we scroll down, you'll find that there is a Yapu config telemetry script. And what you need to do in here, if you're using Express RS and CRSF, is scroll all the way down, almost to the very, very bottom, and you need to enable CRSF support. Make sure that says yes, then Yapu knows that it is looking at at the telemetry screen with the encapsulation of all the telemetry in that kind of CRSF format. And when it works like that, then as you come out, you get it all working and you have all the information appearing in here and you are ready to rock and roll. So those are the only two things really. First of all, on the computer, make sure that you have used pass through for CRSF telemetry selected. That will make sure that the telemetry is getting down. The telemetry appears in your telemetry page and you've discovered all those sensors as you would normally, but also in the Yapu config script, you've turned on CRSF. Thank you for watching my video. Check out the playlist and adding Payless 360 to your search terms will help you find my content. If you haven't done so already, please hit the like and subscribe button. It helps a lot. You can support the time I spend here answering questions and helping others by using the links in the video description.